What's happening in YouTube? Caliber here, and we're here to do another Epic 7 video. We're going to be doing some Guild Wars, guys. Uh, don't forget, uh, you can check me out on Twitch TV on the banner above here every Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday uh, from 6 a.m. Central Standard Time to 12 p.m. Noon Central Standard Time. Let's hop in here and do some Guild Wars. Uh, we're currently going against the Weebs. So it's uh, it's been a hot minute since I've used uh, Charlotte in a video. And since she's had her rework done, I figured we'd get some uses out of her here. Um, so let's go ahead and give this a try. Honestly, I'm not quite sure how well this is going to work. Uh, due to the fact that she's going to probably have an AOE on her S1 versus Violet. But I don't know. We'll see how this works out. Uh, hopefully she can take the hits and this isn't a bad idea. All right. So Crow. Ravi Indian, who do we go for here? Well, immediately, I just want to start working on Ravi. Ravi is going to be super annoying in this comp. Uh, Crow's going to be mitigating that damage, but as long as I can get this Ravi out of the way, that's not very nice. <laughs> yeah, that wasn't very nice. And then Crow's going to get the defense buff out there, which I was hoping I could cut in front of, but I guess not. And then the end. I, I just realized how much of a pain in the ass this fight's gonna be. Uh, this is gonna be taking just a little bit. Yeah, so I'm now looking at this team comp here and realizing this is gonna be really, really rough to take out. Um, I'm thinking maybe I should just start working from DN from the get go. Yeah, I'm thinking I'm gonna have to work DN from the get go. There's not a whole lot I can do here that's going to be beneficial to me. Uh, this DN's just n needing to go right now. She's fast. Everybody on this team's extremely fast. They're keeping up with my 208 speed uh, Tenebria. So, yeah. Alright, so the plan is, is we're going to start chunking DN as hard as we can. As long as DN's alive, I'm not going to be able to do anything. And that's just a huge problem right now. If I can get this DN taken out, though, uh, that's a different story. Question is, can my Eaton withstand the blows? Ooh, this is tempting. So if I see our push Tenebria right now, I can probably... She'll, she'll be fine. She'll be fine. We're going to go ahead and do this. Uh, see if we can get this lucky stun off right here. If not, this might be enough damage to kill her next turn. Uh, there's the stun. There's the stun. Almost enough damage to kill. We're going to punch her. All right. So now we are in good shape. Uh, this is definitely where I want to be. Uh, I'm going to have full control of this now. I'm not worried about Kraut doing his ult because he's only going to be able to do it to Ethan here. So there's really not a whole lot to worry about. This this fight's just been put into checkmate here. Um, are we going to do a burn here? Not yet. We're going to hold these burns. So one thing I do, uh, I do run a very, very fast uh, Spectre Tenebria. And one thing I like to do with her, I like to run her um, basically until I get my um, souls built up. And once I've got my souls built up, I can turn around and do back to back uh, soul burns um, and something like this, man. Something like this. You see that? That's just beautiful, isn't it? And then I get to do another one. It, you really can't go wrong. And then if I had more souls to burn, I could turn around and re-go at it again. Um, I'm actually not going to S3 because of the counter attack. And punching her in the face. Apocalypse Ravi is such an annoying unit to deal with, man. Such an annoying unit. Um, but yeah, this is this is like kind of what I've been doing against uh, Krauss lately. Instead of just, I, I just been tanking them, you know, throwing my Eaton in there with his 25k hit points. Um, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and risk it for the biscuit because if I can get this done, that's going to be beautiful. Didn't get countered there. Did not get countered there. Uh, you know what? I'm just going to see our, let's just see our pusher. I know it's not much, but every little bit counts. Go for double burn here. This 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 is so beautiful, man. Yeah, easy fight there, guys. Uh, I was a little worried with the in at first, uh, but Spectre Tenebria punched through her pretty easily. Uh, this team too, man. I, I I really just don't know. I don't know how this is gonna work. I'm 
hoping it's not bad. Alright, he ate his apple there. Um, going to town on Purgus. I'm, I'm a little concerned about this team. I haven't used Charlotte in a while. I'm just using her just because I haven't used her in a long time. <clears throat> that was a good solid damage. I'm running Oath Key on her too. Just to uh, make her hit better on Violet. Are we already popping that off? Wow, that's early. I feel like that's a little earlier than normal, but that's fine. Uh, you know what? I'm okay with... Let's pop this off. Let's pop this off. So this is kind of good for me because now I don't have to worry about the AOE. Dang, that damage. <sighs> Look at those CR pushes, man. Look at those CR pushes. Just keep on hitting Perg. Give me lots of CR pushes, please. Decrease attack. Very nice. Um, am I going to go for this again? I feel like maybe I can get a provoke off here now. I am not really sure what I want to do there. All right, that's down. Rule's going to do some healing on herself. All right, so at this point in time, now that Violet's off the table, it's going to give me some time to work on Rule without having to worry about anything. I also got a burn up here. I can't use that yet, but that's fine. He's gonna resurrect Violet. Probably, probably. Yeah, that's what I figured. All right, gotta get this rule down, man. Gotta get this rule down. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and bust out with this. And see if I can get some extra DPS out of this. I don't know. I'm kind of at a loss with Charlotte, man. I used to play her a certain way. I know there's, I, I, I've heard lots of different ways of playing her. I just haven't built her up yet. But, you know, it's kind of like. I mean, this is working. I do like her extra thickness she gets, though. I do. I, I just got to look at her in a different light. You know what I mean? Um, all right, let's do this. So we only have Violet left on the table, which makes this super easy. That means this fight is over. Um, see how much damage this does to Violet, man. See, that does some pretty chunky damage to freaking Violet there. Wow. Wow. Dang, man. Um, so he, Charlotte's definitely good at taking out squishy units now. Going Ham's Arena on this. Um, man, am I worried about anything here? Not really. We're going to go for an attack buff here on everybody. Reduce their damage taken. They're going to get attacked buff. This Charles is going to come in and hit like a freaking truck, man. I'm actually a little worried what he's going to hit me for. Um, it. Oh my gosh, I'm running freaking Oath Key on Charlotte. Man, this evasion comp here. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so terrible. If I would have had Portrait on or High Lag, that'd be better. This isn't, this is no bueno. This is no bueno. This is not good. Wow, I can't believe I did that. Oh well. Shields up. Oh. Give me those thick shields, senpai. Boom. AoE attack. They got freaking Elbrus on everybody. And they're all attacking Charlotte. Wow. Are you freaking kidding me? Wow. Okay, he's trying to dispel me. That's fine. Let's pop this off real quick. Get a big hill on everybody. All right, that's fine. Uh, Charles wants a piece of Deanne here. Oh my gosh. Deanne, are you dead? Deanne, are you dead? I think she's dead. I mean, it didn't really matter there because like, oh my gosh, she's dead. Charles is gonna chunk her right now. Oh yeah, she's totally dead. Son of a gun. Don't, don't, don't strip my buffs. Don't strip my buffs. All right. All right. All right. We can still pull this off. 
Dean was just a sacrifice we needed, right? <laughs> Gosh. All right, let's see what happens here. We're going to go for some burns. I got plenty of fighting spirit built up already. Man. I, I was just so used to seeing such bigger damage, man. Such bigger damage. It, it, it makes me a little sad to see her damage now. With, with a team comp like that before, she would have melted them. She would have just 100% melted. It would have been melt zone, man. Oh, oof. do we go for this? Do we go for this? I mean, if I do this, she gets an attack buff, which gives her AOE regardless if she gets provoked or not. So I think that's a good idea. And we'll go like this. Charles is dead. Again. Charles, Charles, you need to chill out, brother. You need to chill out, okay? Oh, you kidding me? Charlotte debut is over, guys. <laughs> All right, that's terrible, man. I... I don't know. I, I'm going to have to rebuild her. I'm going to need to go for, I definitely need to go for something like counter, um, speeds. I don't feel like speeds the answer either. I think counter is probably the only answer that's worthwhile for her and making her thick enough where she's going to freaking like, like her, her, her build has completely changed. Her build is a hundred percent changed from what it, what, what it was. Oh yeah. F Cecilia does that crap. Oh gosh. Am I dead? Wait, what just happened here? Am I dead? Am I dead? Budge. Um. Uh, I'm going to go for a single hit here, man. Budge. No, not like this. Oh my gosh. Freaking Ant Wars. Uh, really don't know how this is going to work out. I'm pretty sure I'm dead um, to the cleave that's going to happen here from Yuna. Because Yuna does a greater attack buff. So this is going to be very interesting how... Oh my gosh, that's a lot of freaking damage that that Tenebria just took. Holy shoot. Alright, let's get Tenebria back up. Boom. She almost died. She almost died. Let's get this Yuna under control real quick. Hold up a second. Let's stun her. I need a stun on her. I really do. Good, 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 good. Provoking, who are you provoking? Fighter Maya, that's fine. We'll cleanse that provoke. Uh, he has greater attack buff on him now. Yuna's a nasty unit, man. That greater attack buff. Woo! It gets thick, man. So I'm actually just going to go ahead and bat her out right now just to be safe she's gone 19k easy we get an extra turn uh, i do not want to play with ken right now um do not want to risk any type of counters happening what i do want to do is get some hills going on real quick all right so we're good now we can attack all right dps right there that's one thing when you're going up against Yunus too in this game, you really, really got to be careful, man. Um, you just don't know, like, you're used to seeing damage done via um, regular attack buff, but the whole greater attack buff can really throw you off on some of these comps. It's so much more damage. I mean, you guys just saw what that Lilius did. She was freaking insane, insane. All right, we're going to work on Lilius here a little bit more. Greater attack buff right there. Boom. Let's go for some DPS right here. All right. Ken's been melted. And boom, Lilius gone. All right. Easy mode, easy mode. A little bit worried, most definitely. That Lilius tore through that freaking Tenebria so quick. Wow. I almost killed my Tenebria turn one because of a greater attack buff. That was that was pretty interesting. All right, we're gonna see our push to the front. We're gonna go ahead and drop this on and all hell, the Church of Elena and the immunity. <laughs> this is my favorite part, man. This is my favorite part about running this comp. The, 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 the fact that like you're, you're just invincible, man, and they get countered to death. 
and it's very satisfying because Charles and S uh, SSB used to be like a huge meta comp together that a lot of people still run. And it's so satisfying just to tear it up. SSB is such a broken unit. Let's see here. Counterattack. Am I just not having any luck here? Holy crap. All right, I am not getting anything counter-wise from Charles. That's disappointing. That is disappointing, a lot, very disappointing. Wow, he has not done one Elbrus rip. Uh, SSB should be dead here though. My freaking, I, I went ahead and built my Charles pure attack or he could just murder things. And it works out very, very well. He has no speed on him whatsoever anymore. Woo! That damage. Are you freaking kidding me? All right, let's just smash him because I want him dead. And he doesn't crit there. Wow. Well, that's all I needed right there. All right, Elena, you're getting close to dying. So I need martial artist Ken and the rest of the Power Rangers here to freaking step it up. All right, you got your beautiful, beautiful attack buff there. You should take them out. All right, S. Cecilia is down. Elena almost died. It's not like it would have mattered. This is my last fight, but still. All right, that's going to wrap up my uh, Charlotte End Wars, guys. Um, man, until I get a set for her, like counter or something like that, and, and make her thicker or something like that. I'm just not going to be running her on any team comps anymore. Uh, she used to be somebody I could reliably run on certain team comps. I'm it's either I'm looking at this through a tunnel vision because I'm used to playing her a certain way, or I'm just struggling to, st I, I don't know, man. I don't know. It, it's a little sad though, because I used to get a lot of good uses out of her. Uh, anyways, besides that, guys, Int Wars, we went, um, four to six. Not too bad. Uh, and I will catch you guys later. Don't forget to hit that like button. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on those notifications. You guys have a good one. See you next week for the next Int Wars or Guild Wars, whatever we choose to make it.